Okay, so I bought this thing a while ago for my uh, Energica. It's an, um, if it is what it, what I think it is, then it's a steal at, uh, it's around 60 euros plus shipping, of course. And, um, what it should be is, is something that extends. It's a, it's a chain guard extension. So the normal chain guard is just this thing. And then the extension goes around here. I've ordered it. Um, yeah, having it here, it's, I, I don't think uh, it's a steal anymore. Well, it, it, it might still be very useful, but I, it was, a, it's on a German website from, uh, Son, Sonoto, no, Snoto, and, uh, that's the brand name. Just judging by the weight. Yeah. Yeah, I thought so. So it's a 3D printed part. Um, if this was like, um, CNC uh, or machined uh, metal, aluminium, then the, the 60 euros would be an awesome deal, a great price. Considering that it's a 3D printed part, 60 euros, in my opinion, is a bit steep. I don't even know which material this is. I ordered on a, on a German website. My German is well enough, apparently, to put an order, to put in my details, to get it uh, sent over and paid for. But it's not well enough to realize that this is uh, not aluminium, but uh, uh, um, well, plastic. The material cost is likely like uh, more like five euros. Even if you, is, well, the hardware is included, even if you put like, uh, if you include the price of the hardware, then it's maybe 10 euros in material cost. So 20 to 30 euros would be a decent price, I think. 60 is a bit steep in my opinion. Anyway, it might still be a great product. So um, there is this part. Yeah, let's also see how it, so yeah, it, it's with a split. So this thing goes in your hollow axle. Fits there and then, yeah, it fits nicely. And then if you tighten it, the bolt will press these sides open. So it's a friction fit that will put this thing here yeah okay it, it fits nicely inside the uh the rear frame of the bike that's a plus so of course i realized there is like uh the the thought and the um there is the design process as well and, and you pay for uh for that also of course this thing just this then just fits in here i guess ah there is an uh a mark here an index so it only fits one way yeah let me get an, uh, an uh, the right tools to uh, open it up and then this is the uh, the outside the protective part and it just bolts on there it says 30 on here I'm not sure why the it is strong though yeah it's definitely strong so I think it will do the job quite well. Yeah, but let's let's just put it on. Ah, there are instructions. There you can find the website as well. And then here's a product picture showing it on. Um, that looks like, um, well, it's not an electric bike for sure. But that's the uh, brand. Okay, so I removed uh, my my side case. That makes for a great bench as well, by the way. So uh, I will be on... Um, oh, well, no, I won't be using this bike. I will be on a trip uh, the coming weekend. We have Easter holidays. I'll be camping, but I'll use my Yamaha. I won't be using this one. Then I just pressed this in here. This form here only fits one way and it fits in there. So alignment should be that easy i'll have to put on the um the guard itself first i see i noticed because the screws are the chain is in the way for the screws otherwise so let's put that first they are quite snug in there yeah but as you can see it's one of those uh molten in inserts if you do a lot of uh, 3d printing that's really nice to have because then you can really assemble things in a strong way Okay, I'll uh, test fit before I uh, completely screw them back in. Let's 
so this is the closest. Yeah, it clears the chain, so I'll uh, I'll put it on the closest um, setting. I don't know why this one is so hard to thread in. Okay, I'm just doing it by hand, of course. And then, oh, so these two are in place like this. Yeah, this is definitely working. So it's solid, it's on there. Let's see if we can f um, see the alignment from here. So this is the alignment from the rear. So it's almost, I would say it's perfectly centered with the chain. And then... Let's see if we can spot it through the wheels as well. To have a view of the other side. Yeah, there you can see the other side also. But that's what it looks like. It goes up to there and, and the other one goes up to there. So the, the top is completely covered. We'll see how, uh, how well it stays in place. But I, I have a, a good feeling that it seems Except for the price, it seems strong. This is on there from now on. It will stay on as long as it doesn't break.